So back with another quick tool review and um, this is just on some pre precision uh, drill bits that we've got here running from uh, 0.1 up to 1mm and there's 10 drill bits in this uh, set. Uh, this is another eBay product that I find it's best just to pick up from there because uh, they're relatively cheap. I tend to break all of the ones down below sort of 0.5 of a mil uh, regularly so uh, these are under sort of uh, I think around the £3 mark. Now I've already in opening the box broken 0.1 um, now I wouldn't probably ever have any use for 0.1 or 0.2 my other set was uh, ranged from 0.3 up to 1.3 but I do find these are ex exceptionally sharp uh, more so than the type that you'd get that are like this um, that I used to use I find these more needed sort of drill bit this type um, and they need to be put into a drill bit and they're not quite sharp they need a bit more sort of work to get them to start whereas these you can do them by hand oh hang on this is what here you can see why I actually <laughs> break them so easily so uh, you can they're thick enough to do by hand and um, you can also put them in a drill bit but they're very very sharp uh, so drilling out gun barrels exhausts that sort of thing in small scales it's it's really good for um, so if I just pick one of these, this is uh, 5, so they've got colour codes but you've also got it printed on the um, drill bit there as well, what it is. If I just get a piece of plastic card here, and um, this is just an old vac form kit. So just by starting, this is hardly any pressure, I just sort of twist back and forth and then try and get um, an entire turn and here we're all start already starting to go. I'm just kind of rolling between my thumb and four fingers. Um, and you can see that the material's coming up the drill bit. <coughs> and then we are through. Uh, I do find that they tend to do this sort of spiralling. They don't sort of cut, so you have to kind of pull back as you're twisting just to get a clean cut. And as it gets to the base, it tends to do it. And this is actually how I break some of the um, some of the smaller ones. That's the only thing I find that um, is a bit of a problem. There we go, we've got it now. Now we're getting a full-on twist. There you go, so you can pull out. And that's when you know you've got a good um, a hole drilled, as opposed to it, it might have a bit of debris in there. Now, I don't know how well that's showing up. It's a bit glary with white on white, but we're looking at this hole here. And that's what we've uh, got. And as you can see, so that's 0.5 mil. Um, it's a very nice hole, it's very clear and round and then you can see the drill bit going in. Um, so it's exceptionally good for sort of, uh, you know, when you're looking at um, gun barrels in, in, uh, in wings for instance, so like a Hurricane Spitfire 109, that sort of thing, or drilling out um, extended guns, again like uh, FW-190s, that sort of thing. And any other part that requires um, drilling out. So there you go, might be something of interest, and um, I thought that might be worth showing. Uh, so there's a little bit of technique on how to use them, that is what they are, and the actual name uh, that I've got here is Union Tool um, Precision Drill Bits from 0.1 up to 1mm. Um, uh, I've also in the past had, which I think are actually slightly better than these myself, was this one which is Drill Pro, um, and in, if we'll have a look in here you'll see how many I've broken. Um, all of these up to here, even the tip's broken there, so I can never get that to actually bite very well. They're broken, so I've only got, uh, it starts at three, so we've got four, five, six. So I've got seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So it goes up to 1.2, I think. Yeah, it does. 1.2. So I've got those as uh, duplicates, and then that gives me a, a few extras in here as well. But I mean, I must have had these for two or three years, uh, and I've only just broken them recently, so um, I think it's a wise investment. And another Another um, product worth adding to your uh, tool collection for scale modelling.